So green light's on, money set in motion, about to jump. Race one, and they're off, and uh, spreading out early there was Stella Force going forward was We're So Lucky and punching through Exciting Dream. Wider on the track, we go to Ruby Tron, trying to track into it, further back to Percentage Man and Company with Pure Theatre, and back on the inside is Bubble Osti. It's Stella Force about to lead them home here from We're So Lucky, Exciting Dream out wide on the track, Ruby Tron, but it's all Stella Force back-to-back, -back, has beaten We're So Lucky. Now, third across would have been their Exciting Dream narrowly, I think, just ahead of Ruby Tron. They were followed in by Percentage Man, and the two at the back were Bubble Osti and Pure Theatre. First over the middle distance today. And they're racing. Good jump here from Sky High Levo. Showing up early CKD. And out wider on the track was Legree. And behind them is Mitty for Mum. And then looking up to uh, get into it was Worth a Crack. Further back in the field to Tennessee Ave. And at the tail of the field is Opie Bossman. And there's another one up ahead of them. And that is Diamond Walk. Just a little bit wider on the track. But down they go. And the uh, field lead here by CKD by a margin of about five and a half lengths. Leads from Sky High Levi. Line third is Legree on the inside of Mitty for Mum. And out wider still was Diamond Walk. But up comes CKD. Another back to back. Has gone on to beat Sky High Levi and Mini for Mum got third, followed in by Legree. Then we had wider on the track, Diamond Watt just never really got onto the track, to be fair. Further back in the field, we would have had uh, Worth a Crack back there was Opie Bossman, disappointing, and Tennessee Ave was the last to go by. Almost there. And racing. Good jump here from Agent Van Elder, but not as good as Boss Lady Sloy. She zips around to take the lead. Blue Jean Ellis there in second. There's a whole pack of them there with Kinetic Neo. Asia Osti just got shunted towards the rear and Thrilling Abra just ahead of it. But it's Boss Lady Sloy about to lead them home from Agent Van Elden right there. Kinetic Neo and down on the inside. Blue Jean Ellis right on the track. Whoa, I think uh, Boss Lady Sloy just held Agent Van Elden. Just seemed to fly in the last stages there. Kinetic Neo was third ahead of Thrilling Abra. Blue Jean Ellis the favourite. A bit disappointing there. And Asia Osti was the last to go by. And racing, run Lacey, run away quickly with La Dark down on the inside. Kissing Kate shows early toe and Harvey Nichols further back in the pack to Sharf. Back on the inside, B Rabbit joint last with either Gladys. It's run Lacey, run. And she too shooting for back to back here. She leads by a length from up on the outside. La Dark through the inside. Harvey Nichols getting through. Run Lacey, run. Favourite too good. Harvey Nichols and La Dark. And they were followed in by for fourth. We had a photo there. Could be the uh, one kissing Kate narrowly from Sharf. And the two at the back would be Rabbit and either Gladys. Two of them never in it. Favourite out of seven, Gogo -Go Rioli. First time here at Monaco. And jumps OK as well as Gogo -Go Rioli. Not quite as fast as Run Lace, uh, Run Stacey, Run and also Lachlan Valley up there. Wide on the track was Stap Me Up. Gogo -Go Rioli's just getting shuffled back towards the rear. Just ahead of it is section and Utah Bolt weaving its way through with Senorita Chang and Armour. Up they come, Run Stacey, Run from Stap Me Up and on the inside section. But it's Run Stacey, Run gets home. Another back-to-back -back winner, A eh? Gets up to beat Stap Me Up. Third across would have been Utah Bolt ahead of section. And uh, the others we're back there. We had Senorita Chang, Arma, Lachlan Valley, and Gogo -Go Rioli. No luck today was one of the last to go by. Run, Stacey, run.
And racing, she pings. Bright Star goes straight to the lead and puts three lengths on them easily. Little Rascal runs into second. Secret Star, wider there was Holland Badger and company with all and all on the improve. Further back to Family's Pride and Exciting Girl. It's Bright Star, she leads by two lengths. Family's Pride giving her a good chase here. And down the outside, further back is all and all. But Bright Star, she's a bright one, all right. She gets home from Secret Star and all and all. Fourth home would have been Holland, oh, Holland Badger or Little Rascal. They're pretty tight. They were followed in by Family's Pride and one at the back would have been Exciting Girl. And they're racing. Good speed out wide here from Miss Pyro. Shutting through in the middle there was Ginger Jam. And just ahead of it was Miss Apocalypse. To now go and take up to the lead with uh, Miss Pyro, who now retains it. Now endorse gets through. Now Miss Apocalypse ran a Ginger Jam off the track there. And Corborn Penny now runs into third. Further back in the field, we've got uh, Ike Jones, second to last. And on the house is last of all. The leader is endorsed. Leads by three lengths from the Tyree Miss Pyro. Down on the inside is Corborn Penny. And up on its outside, Ginger Jam. But up comes endorsed. Down in class. And up in distance, she gets home and Dorse to beat home. Corborn Penny, nice run. Ginger Jam third, followed by Al Burney. Then we had Miss Pyroar in company with Ike Jones and the two at the back, Miss Apocalypse, and on the house. And they're racing, tried at Lotto, just a little bit slow away. Their explosive Osti comes out well with Double Magic running and Cosmic Pearl, the th uh, three, uh, wider on them. Followed back in the field by Lord Will. Now on the inside, tried at Lotto's going to have to be very good from there. Knockham's further back with This Is Whip and Fiery Dancer. But up comes Explosive Osti. Explosive Osti goes down to beat Double Magic and Cosmic Pearl. Then we had back in fourth would have been Lord Will ahead of tried at Lotto, the favourite. This Is Whip and the last two were Knockham and a Fiery Dancer. Good luck with your quaddy. And they're off and racing. Jets and Blaze jump well. Also middle of the pack there. Fancy Jill showing up early with Mackinnon and Lafayette. Then we go back to Uncle Romilly just trying to angle its way into the race and now runs a fourth down on the inside. About half a length away back to Jets and Blaze with the tyree Mackinnon. Big time Karen is next followed by Lockenbar on it. And last of all is Lockenbar Vicini. Off the top they go. And the leader is Fancy Jill looking to go one beater here today. She leads by four from Lafayette. Third is uh, Jets and Blaze and back on the inside Uncle Romilly. Fancy Jill. She'll hang in there. Fancy Fancy Jill from the late diving Jets and Blaze. He came out of nowhere. Looked like he was going to get third. He's definitely got second, I think. Then we had Lafayette and company with big time Karen, Uncle Romilly, and the two at the back with Mackinnon. And also back there was Lockenbar Vicini. And they're racing good speedy from Positivity going up with it was Seven Iron and wider on the track really Ninja and even wider was Newton Willow tracking into it was Diva Road and behind them Lockavar Brando with the favourite he's trying to get into get himself into the race and last of all is Thrilling Charge the favourite's not having a good uh, good time today as Thrilling Ninja takes them down the back and leads by five lengths from Seven Iron line third is Newton Willow and about a gap of a length and a half back to Thrilling Charge further back to Lockavar Brando with Positivity and Diva Road up comes Thrilling Ninja now Seven Iron comes at it and Thrilling Charge through on the end 
inside, thrilling charge, that's the winning run. We'll get up to beat Seven Iron, who got second, and the uh, faltering late thrilling ninja, followed in by local, uh, Lockenbar Brando with uh, Newton Willow, and the last two to cross would have been Positivity and Diva Road. Fancy tip now, three dollars eighty. Set and to go, set ready to go, and they're off and racing. Harajuku Baby showed up early with Reddy Ranger and Pink Bouquet between them. Further back to Osti's Experience and Company there with Indy Road, a bit of squeezing there out of the home uh, the home straight. And Fancy Tip up there closer. Further back to Indy Rana Rizmir, and last of all is Just Your Data. She's going to have to get a big move on from there. It's Reddy Ranger being eyeballed by Osti's Experience, and up on the outside coming three wide is Fancy Tip. Further back in the field to Indy Rana Rizmir, and Indy Road could be the sneaky killer. Indy Road, Fancy Tip still leads, and Fancy Tip will get through with Reddy Ranger. So Fancy Tip and Reddy Ranger will see them back here next week. The third home, Indy Road, they were followed in by Harajuku Baby, Pink Bouquet, Just Jordana, and Austi's Experience. And they're racing. Good line here from Ima Spice and jumping well with it was Hot Lass and down on the inside was Legend B. Length and a half back to Clover Appeal with Mahoney. Wide on the track to Tata Punga with Cosmic Mac trying to improve and last of all is Emma J. Ima Spice about to lead them up the straight here from Legend B. Further back to Cosmic Mac and out wide Tata Punga but Ima Spice he loves boss one. Ima Spice gets home to beat either closely Legend B or Cosmic Mac photo there. They were followed in by Hot Lass and then we had Tata Punga. Back with it was Clover Appeal, Mahoney and also back at the tail of the field would have been Emma J, not today.